Okay, this is a good place to show it. So in our 2442558 reference area, there are all of these chords. There are 52, and if we start right here, they begin in the minor scale. But that's not what we're choosing to compose with now. We have decided to pick a subset of these 52 chords, 14 chords in fact, and the first place where they start for us to use is not until the major scale. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Motion Part 35, Re-Enter Part 2. In today's episode, we re-entered by reflecting that our goals for these stream series have evolved. It's this is like the sixth series now. Um, these series give us energy to fuller, more fully express ourselves musically and beyond uh, because of you, chat. Um, and they also help our other less musically related projects, mostly 3D platforms and, and events and such, videos, and vice versa. So our challenge, we feel, is to expand our perspective about what musically related can include. And that's why we keep saying, you know, composing in 2662, composing in full media, using animation, composing in uh, pentatonic parallel, using four scales at once, um, composing um, uh, in multiple dimensions where we had multiple tool sets and, and used the, the Firestorm 3D platform and other things. And now we're in composing in motion, which includes performing live and Lord knows what else. So for now, we're using music as an ensemble player now in a creation as well as the soloist example accompanying a video. So these are a bunch of projects we want to include in this series. Um, and our, our guidance is the stream is the stream is the stream, no matter what category label we have, which is music. We want to respect the interest and attention of stream chat, both current chat and potential chat. And we want to extend the music and extend the idea of full self-expression in the process, which we think is a shared interest with chat. We also have a new theme today, geography, and we think it's on our mind because of all the recent 3D world exploration we've been doing, this, especially this last week. We did look up and find a cool image to help guide us. Um, you probably know this, geography means the earth and to write, uh, to scratch or carve. So we have this cool image of hills versus mountains, which we think we could reflect musically with a smooth and a, and a pokey kind of sound. In any event, we got a lot of new work done. We, we finished uh, making that animation gallery that we showed you yesterday. Um, this one here, it's ready to post online for the artist to see. It starts like this. The most important thing is we spelled the name correctly. Anyway, it's really cool imagery. And again, the music is, is playing the role of an accompanist. And the star is the uh, digital art by Mad Delirium. So that's ready to go. Um, we did a bunch of other stuff. Uh, the main thing we did is we figured out what composition we wanted to work on. So we were looking at our checklist. And these four scales in red were the four scales we picked to work with in this series. We have done that one called Returning, this one Lines of Demarcation Part 1, uh, this one Lines of Demarcation Part 2, and then this one most, most recently finished was Standalone Chords Improvisation 3. And um, if you remember what the standalone chords are, and that's important, it's we took all the possible chords in all nine scales and we said, are there any chords that are not found anywhere else. And for the C minor major scale, we found 13, but we also found for the C2442, 14 chords that are nowhere else. So we said, well, let's see, let's, let's compose something with that. So that's what we're going to do. And we're going to show you what we came up with. But anyway, that is now in progress. Bing, 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 now in progress. So we've kind of, now we've jumped out of our four scales to the fifth scale. 
So in particular, we were showing you what happened that we took our 52 chords, we narrowed them down to 14, and this is what we've come up with so far. And we'll play that for you, and that'll bring us home. Here we go. What we like about it is that we got nine lines composed. It's all of 45 seconds, and we all know to get from 45 seconds to anything on the scale of three minutes or more, there's a lot more fun stuff to do here. Um, but we do have two, we feel, clear sub arcs that have a nice, pleasing progression. We also like that we basically, we, we started with picking out backbone melodies that we liked and and then matching them with cadences we did a little bit of both back and forth but we definitely did more emphasis on picking out backbones and then matching cadences and again uh, the cool thing about all this is there are only 14 allowed chords and all of them are in there so that concludes today's stream our ideas for next time are uh, like we said we're going to post the madelarium video uh, we want to continue our reference sheet updates and our related projects, but basically we'll be working on that composition. So acknowledgments to Mr. Spatz who stopped by and Miss Cleo. Do take care, do come back, and do keep on streaming.